Hey guys, what a gorgeous day it is today. It is absolutely perfect outside, but I am headed inside. I am off to the thrift store. I'm always looking for dolls and toys or anything else that kids and I collect. So I'll see you when I get to the thrift store. So guys, we just got here and I look quickly at the doll section and there doesn't seem to be a lot of bags. So I'm gonna do this section first and see what's here. So the first thing I see is this bag. Looks like a Moxie Girl. Uh, the bag is $3.99, but I like her. I've seen her a lot. Let me just hold on to this bag. I'm just gonna put that in my thing. Oh, wow, these are antiques. Interesting. Oh, they're $2.99. I like them. I'll, I'll hold on to them too. Oh, that was weird. So let's keep looking. Oh, wow, that's Star Wars there. That's the Millennium Falcon. Okay, well, piece of plastic. I'll just leave it there. Two dolls. We're gonna go right through this doll area. because, As you guys can see, let me step back. Not a whole lot here, but I'm gonna be able to take a look at each one individually. Okay, so let's go down here. She looks a little vintage. And she's with this little girl. And this is $2.99. I don't know who she is. But this bag is $2.99. This girl looks vintage. And I don't know who she is, but I like her. I mean, I like her clothes as well, so we might get this bag. So let's keep looking, okay. Two nice dolls. This one looks extra long for some reason, but I'll leave them. Okay. Okay, some more Barbies over there. More Barbies. Two more Barbies in this bag. This store is really reasonable. They're charging $3.99 for two dolls. Let's see. The Disney dolls over there. This looks like a vintage doll. She's very plastic. So let's keep looking. Okay. Okay. This girl is jointed. Very pretty. With a boy doll. Let's see how much this is. This is $3.99. Okay, and there's a bag on the floor here. Let's pick that up and take a look. Whoa, wow. Okay, somebody took a Sharpie to her face. It's $1.99, no wonder. Let's hang it up here, nice and proud. Hopefully somebody will take her home. I'm going to work my way all the way down. I'm gonna skip all these bags. I might come back to them. Ooh, except I see little figures here. Oh my gosh, this is $1.99. This is Groot, love Groot. And this is $2.99. Look at all these figures. Okay, I might just hold on to these. Oh my gosh, and right behind that is a squishy. Look at that, that's a squishy, this is Stitch. So I'm not gonna get it. I don't like the way it feels. Oh my gosh, look at, look at this. This is $3.99, there's three boy dolls here. Okay, now this is something I might get. Let me tell you guys why. This is a One Direction doll here and he's wearing clothes that fit pull-up dolls. So this is $3.99, big bag. Looks like it's already ripped open. I'm gonna think about this. So I'm gonna put that in. These little figures, if, I'm gonna take a look at them. If they're from McDonald's, I'm gonna put them back. But this is what we have so far. I'm gonna make my way down here, skipping all these little bags. And I'll tell you why, because take a look at the floor here, guys. This is the weekend. Oh my gosh, look at this poor decapitated doll. This is the weekend, and this place is totally, totally a mess. Look at the floor. Wow. It is completely messed up. Oh, look at that cute little singer song machine in the box. Okay, so let's go to the end and then work our way back. Wow, everything is on the floor. Take a look at it. So there's some Barbies here. Some kids were having a great time today. So look at the little treasure chest. Very cute. So I'm going to take a quick scan. Oh my gosh, look at this. $4.99, One Direction. This is Lewis Tomlinson. Okay, we'll leave him here. So let's keep going. Let's see what's here. 
Look at what they've done to the plush bin. Can't even reach anything. It's all the way, things are all the way down there. But I'm going to make my way back looking at the loose toys to see what's here. Oh, look at This is Pinocchio. I'm going to leave him here. He is in really bad condition. Darth Vader on the floor over there. I'm just trying to see. Oh, wow. What you hear is my cart trying to get through the toys. So let's keep looking and see if there's any loose dolls here for us today. Some vintage looking dolls. Old guy. $3.99. Okay. Yes. Oh, that's so cute. Looks like a Lala Loopsie house, a doll dress. Okay, this is a quick one today. This really looks empty out here, guys. Let's see. What's here? Okay. And this is like a locker, like the American Girl kind of locker. It's very cute. Uh, we're going to leave it here. And there's a little horse, $4.99 over there. Something is ticking, of course. And there's a porcelain doll here, all by herself out of here. So, what is ticking? I don't even know what's ticking, but I can hear it. I'm just going to keep going. Look at that, somebody left their coffee. Baby, baby alive over here. Oh, look at that, a doll, a Barbie type doll on the shelf, all alone. So, let's keep going. Okay, we did the loose toys. Now I am going to look at all these bags. Okay, giving it a quick scan. Looking for my usual Tsum Tsums. Oh, tiny kawaii plush. Oh, how cute that I don't have. So I'm going to just give it a quick look. Okay, oh, it's cute. Oh my goodness, guys, this is a bag of Tsum Tsums. This is $2.99. I see Olaf. It looks like Dumbo. Uh, is that Goofy? There's one, two, three, and um, some Thai beanies. So definitely get in that bag. This is why we're here. For bags just like that. So now I am so excited. I'm going to take a closer look. I was just going to breeze right by not thinking that there was anything but once you find one bag you hope for more so you keep looking so that was very good but i'm very happy with that one bag that came our way so let's, let's give it a quick look here okay some more small Oh my gosh, guys, this is $1.99. This is a bag of clear shoes, high heel shoes. I don't know what I could do with it, but for $1.99, I'm just going to put it in the cart. And let's see what else is here. I don't know what that is. Okay, let's keep going. Let's see. Oh my goodness, guys, take a look. This is $2.99, and I see a Sum Sum here. But if, uh, yep, Sum Sum is still tagged. Oh my gosh, that's fabulous. I wonder if, but it's just that one. Hmm, I'm not sure. I can get them for $2.99 at Target, brand new. So for that one, I'm going to pass, unfortunately. If it's just the one. It's a little porcelain doll in here with a baby. Very cute. See what's over here. Ooh, is that a Samsung? Samsung? Um, no, it's not. I don't think. Nope, it's a tie. Okay, so beanie. Oh, these are cute. Let's see what else is here? I, wonder, I don't know what these polka dotted guys are. They're cute. They're very cute. Let's see what's over here. I love these are squishies. Oh my gosh, they're so cute. So yeah, I might have to move these guys aside and get these squishies for $2.99. They're very cute. 
so I'm going to keep looking. And oh my gosh, guys, check this out. This is an American Girl dog. This is chocolate chip for $3.99. We're definitely going to get it. And it's with a, um, a Beanie Boo. Yes, we're definitely going to get this. And chocolate chip is wearing the helping harness. Perfect. So let's keep looking. There goes another polka dotted little guy. I don't know who it is. If you guys know, let me know. Take a look at this. Baby alive on the floor and a mermaid. Barbie on the floor. Let's put them all together. They could keep each other company. You never know what you're going to find. And take a look at this. Looks like Polly Pockets in there. We're not going to get it. We have a huge bin of Polly Pockets that Bella keeps threatening to organize. Okay, so let's keep going. Check these out. A big bag of blow-up microphones for kids' party. So let's keep looking here. Let's see, oh wow. Guys, check this out. This is a bag of Skylanders for $4.99 tons of Skylanders. I remember paying like 15 or 16 dollars each for my son Oliver to buy some Skylanders. Oh my god. Things have really changed. Some baseball cards back there. And these look like they would be these would make great drinks, but we have things for that for the dollhouse. So let's keep going and see what's here. I keep looking. This is very, this is very cute. Can I see what's here? Oh, I know this is Moana. Oh, it's Moana. From Moana. Okay. Let's see. What else is here? Let's take a look. Okay. Oh, look at this. Some plush over here. Okay. So it looks like I've almost come back to where I was. Oh, let's see. Oh, guys, take a look at this. This is $3.99. And I think this is a briar horse. I'll take a closer look and perhaps we'll get it. I'm going to see this other horse is here. And I can tell immediately these are not briar. That one felt like briar. I can just like feel it and I know it's a briar. I've been collecting for years, so. Oh, it is a cute little piggy bank. That's vintage. We have one similar in my shop. Oh my gosh, guys, more Skylanders. A lot more Skylanders, wow. Oh my goodness, it goes way up. Somebody just let go of all their Skylanders. Wow, okay. We're in the little boy truck section and we're back to the dolls. So I'm gonna see what's in the other part of the store. Okay, I took a closer look at this horse and I looked at the mark, it's not a briar, so it's going back. So let's see what's behind here. Oh, it's ponies. Okay, looks like we have those, they're only $2.99. And check this out, this is a whole bunch of magnets for $4.99. Okay, let's continue and see Wow, check this out guys, this is a giant pear and a little Mickey Mouse tool bench. This is only $4.99, that's a great deal. Let's see, oh my gosh guys, check this out. This is a brass merchant server for a merchant to serve, somebody used it as a planter, to serve tea outdoors, like in a bazaar. I'm gonna see how much this is because this looks like something I might have to take home. And I don't see a price anyway. Somebody, this shouldn't be here though. But I'll take a look at it. I'll take a closer look at it. So we're in the arts and crafts section, guys, and take a look at this. There's an American girl craft. You make two pillows. It's only $2.99. This is a good deal. But I'm not a fan of this fabric that's included. And take a look. This is the Hello Kitty soap dispenser. How much? $1.99. No, we're going to pass on. It's sort of grossing me out. And this is a display for bracelets. I might be able to use that in the shop, but 
let's just keep going. Let's see what else is in here. Let me see. Huh. Making our way to this area with the games and stuff. See, I always look for sealed games. I don't see any. Um, let me see. No. Okay. And this is more kitchen utensils, crafts, supplies. Sometimes you find odd things here for like odd toys here, but I don't see any today. I'm just, oh my gosh, look at plush right here. So somebody obviously changed their mind. Let's let these go over here. See, this is why you have to look everywhere. You never know what's going to be here. Oh, some nice stamps. $3.99. Okay. I'm just going to keep looking. Oh, this is cute. Look at all these little display stands to hold things. Well, very cute. They're $2.99 each. That would be good in a shop. I'm very tempted, but I think I'm going to pass. So I'm going to keep looking. And here's a sneak peek at what it looks like behind Savers. This is after work, so nobody's here now. But take a look, guys. This is what it looks like behind the scenes. So now this is the other section of crafts. So look at this. This looks like doll clothes, but I don't think it is. So I'm making my way to the porcelain doll section over here. So let's see. Oh my god. Look at this. This is cabbage patch. They're $19.99 each. They're porcelain. So, and they're from the Olympics. So yeah, I'm going to just leave those. Oh my gosh, look at this. This is the Stargate $5.99. Aliens. These are box toys. Oh my gosh, look at these. Game of Thrones. Look at all these toys. They're in the box. The Skylander in the box. Lots of Skylanders in the box. Somebody really just... Okay guys, let's take a quick look over here at the porcelain dolls. There's just a lot of cabbage patch. This is $3.99. This one's $3.99 as well, but it's very dirty. And I'm looking to see this. This is a doll that's not porcelain, but the face is squished in. And okay, so these are the porcelain dolls up here. Looks like we're done guys. So guys, we're going to put back these two bags. There were two, this one was $1.99 and this one was $2.99. These are just McDonald's figures. So we're gonna pass on them. We'll put them right back next to Stitch where we found them. Take a look here, see if I missed anything. No, okay. Okay, so it looks like we're, oh my gosh guys, take a look at this. This is Hello Kitty for $1.99. I'm so glad I came back to return those items because I didn't see this the first time around. And behind it is like a little bag that would be perfect for like a Corito kid. So I'm definitely going to pick up this Hello Kitty purse for $1.99. And wow, guys, look it. It looks like this is Big Hero 6 Baymax deconstructed and it's only $3.99. I don't know how I missed this the first time. Or was it just returned here? I don't remember. What's up here? A little lunch box. Uh, I'm so tempted, but no, I'm going to leave it. I'm just going to put Hello Kitty in the cart. So guys, we're going to put the boys back. I'm at the regular store. I'm looking them over. I don't want to get him because his sleeve is very dirty and we don't need it. Guys, this is everything we got today at the thrift store. I'm going to move all these bags out of the way so we can look at this beautiful brass piece that we got. So were you guys able to guess what this piece is? It has these compartments that clip on the side. See, it clips on. It, it clips on the side and this one came with three that clip on and then it has a door that you can unhook and two shelves here. And the bottom is probably to hold heated items. Look at the doors. 
this sort of have an Asian look to them in the cutout. This is a vintage piece. This is the Asian brass and glass street vendors food caddy. They're the shelves for little desserts. The person who owned this um, added this thing here to make it a planter, but I can easily remove that. This is a place you can add more food items, but it comes with all these pieces that clip onto the side. This Asian street vendors caddy in brass and glass is our gem for today. And they charged us $7.99 at the register. Pieces like this usually sell around $75 to $125. Let's stay with the brass theme for a little while longer. We got these two brass hooks for $2.99. So out of the bag, I call these hooks, but they could be curtain tiebacks or anything else you want. They apparently attach to something here. Not 100% sure, but I, you can use them as a curtain tie back or just as even just a decorative addition to like a fence post or something. But I can use them as a hook as well. You put them like that. One's a fish and this one appears to be a pheasant. We got both of these pieces for $2.99. The next bag was $3.99 and we got it because it, it contains this American Girl dog. So out of the bag, we have Chocolate Chip here, the dog, wearing a helping harness. And then we have this Thai Beanie Boo. This is Midnight and it's in really great condition. We'll probably sell him in our store. The next bag, Contains some Tsum Tsum and we paid only $2.99 for it. So out of the bag, we got three Tsum Tsum, Dumbo, Olaf, and Goofy, and two Thai Beanie Boos. These are the small ones. This is Penny, the striped pink one, and Oscar. He is also a keychain. So now for the dolls. We have this bag that contains two dolls that I really like for $3.99. I've seen her before several times, but now she's packaged with a doll that I also want. So that's why I picked it up today. So out of the bag, we have a Moxie Girl doll here. This one over here. She is made by MGA Entertainment, the same company that makes Bratz. And this beautiful girl over here is a Disney Fairies doll. She's Tinkerbell's friend. And her name is Fira, F-I-R-A. I just love her translucent skin tone and she's in excellent condition. And her hair appears to be in the original braid. So we're definitely going to keep her in our collection. And we'll probably keep the Moxie Girl too, but we do have a lot of Moxie Girl dolls. This next bag was $2.99 and I got it for this cute little doll here. She reminds me of the Lori dolls. So out of the bag, like, let's take a look at this little girl first. She is a Madame Alexander doll. She is marked on the back of her head and her outfit is also tagged Madame Alexander. And this Barbie doll here, she looks like she has a, a shorter neck than usual and she needs to be cleaned up. We'll probably sell her in our shop or maybe trade her for something else that we want. But this little girl we're going to keep in our collection. And I think even her outfits could fit the mini American Girl dolls and the Lori dolls. So we're going to keep her. This next bag is hard to see, but it's $1.99 and it contains um, plastic high heel shoes. So take a look at this, guys. There are nine high heel shoes here. They would be perfect for those ideal dolls, but they appear to be a little big. I'm sure we're going to craft something out of them and probably sell it in our store or use it for our dolls. This last bag needs no explanation. It was only $1.99 and contains a Hello Kitty camera case or a little purse. And behind it is a small bag for a bigger doll. So out of the bag, let's take a look at this one first. It is a woven bag with a little tag there and it zips up. I'm going to try it next to a doll to see the scale. 
But take a look at this. This is a Hello Kitty nicely constructed bag with a little tab here to pull it. And when you open it up, there's Velcro closure here. The two zippers unzip to reveal the tag here that this is an authentic piece because it's marked Sanrio, the company that makes Hello Kitty. This is just an overall cute piece. We don't have it and I'm happy to add it to our collection. So guys, this is everything we got today at the thrift store. What an oddball day. You never know what you're going to find. That's why you have to look all over. We found pieces to sell in our shop and dolls to add to our collection. If you have any questions, please let me know in the comments. And if you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. Thank you so much for watching. See you next time.